Okay, here we go. <sighs> and so we do acknowledge the forces of light, asking for guidance, direction, and courage to know the truth as it is revealed for our highest good and the highest good of everyone connected to us. O oh, Holy Spirit of God, help me to know Karen in the light of the Akashic Records, to see Karen through the eyes of the Lords of the Records, and enable me to share the wisdom and compassion that the Masters, Teachers, and Loved Ones I'm Karen have for her. The records are now open. Hmm. So Karen wants to know, Karen wants to know, how and why am I blocking myself from having financial abundance? Oh, dear one. Hmm. Forget the hows. The hows do not matter. That, oh, that is one of the problems <coughs> in many areas of your life, focusing on the how, being concerned, being stuck. It, the hows really get you stuck. Forget the house, the why. The why is what matters. Solve the why, and the house take care of themselves. So, the why, it's worthiness. Hmm. You don't believe you're worthy of what, hmm, what part of you is asking for. There's a lot of ancestral heritage around the notion of needing to struggle, around the belief that People with more than they need are somehow not good. Wasteful. Ah, there is, there is something about, there's pride in being a spend. Wow, I can't even get this word out. Spend, spend. Being a spendthrift is bad. Being a miser is good. Spendthrift, spread. Spendthrift, spread, thrift, spend. Spend, thrift. Spend shrift. No, oh, boy. Huh. It is... They say it's the resistance. Your stuckness in the how is coming across in the stuckness in conveying words. Hmm. So, why? Why is Karen blocking herself from the financial abundance? Yeah. There's... There's, there's, there's fear of being considered or labeled a spendthrift. That is, it feels very deeply rooted to your father, but it goes beyond that. It, again, it is ancestral. Hmm. There is a bit of a vow to your family to, to not outshine, to not outsucceed, to not outearn, to not gather more financial means than you necessarily need and need is not even defined by you need is being defined again by the trough you've allowed yourself to live in it's this trough it's this container created by society by your family by your ancestry by your agreeing that okay this is my life this trough this v-shaped path is my life but your life and your means your expression are infinite The how doesn't matter. The how doesn't matter. Focus on the why. Praise your own worthiness. Nurture yourself. Give yourself permission to break out of the patterns, to break out of the role, to break out of the V, to break out of the trough, to break out of everything that you've been laying in, thinking it's for the benefit of you and your family and, and a way of honoring your upbringing. It is not. It is not. There is nothing holy. There's nothing sanctimonious. There's nothing precious. There is there is nothing better, more about being a spendthrift than about being fabulously wealthy. Right? Money is just energy. You've allowed it to... Mm, you've been treating it more, much more than that. Allow 
money, allow currency to flow in and out of your life, in and out of yourself, as easily as you allow air to flow in and out. As easily as you allow sunshine to flow in and out of each day. Okay. I would like to thank the masters, teachers, and loved ones for their love and compassion. I would like to thank the <laughs> I would like to thank the Lord of the Akashic Records for their point of view, and I would like to thank the Holy Spirit of Light for all knowledge and healing. The records now closed. Amen. The records now closed. Amen. The records now closed. Amen.